Can one person make a difference in another person's life? You make a difference, even if it's only one person and you just gave them a smile. We always hear the saying, it takes a village to raise a child, but I think sometimes it takes one good solid person. Prayer makes a difference and people make a difference. I am Larry Arborough, chaplain here in the YMCA of Middle Tennessee. We pray for incredible success in our work of ministries. The chaplain's ministry is specific. It's like being a pastor to a company, not to a church. I came here and I just felt like I needed something and I got here and at first I was intimidated by everything that was going on. We did some I'm Jenny Beadle. I'm the wellness director at the Franklin YMCA. She is absolutely more than a wellness director. I think the most important thing that I do every day is interact with the members. Uh, when they walked in the door, you have no idea what's happening to them outside of them. <laughs> they could have just lost a loved one. They could have just lost their job. You just don't know what they're struggling with. And you smiling and letting them know that they're important and using their name and you know, helping them learn a piece of equipment that's confusing them or frustrating them. You make a difference. You make them feel loved. Come on in, guys. Get your stuff settled. Once you've found your trash away and you have homework. I'm Rachel Whited, and I'm an area coordinator with School Age Services. I wear many hats. I, um, I'm there for the kids. I'm a role model. I am that link between the school and home life. She takes her job very serious. If you're interested in staying in here and playing games, please go ahead and dismiss yourselves. She doesn't take anything from the kids, but at the same time, she shows them a lot of love. I am the psychologist, the, you know, the boo-boo healer, the, you know, just the confidant and the friend and the shoulder to cry on sometimes. But most importantly, I am a positive role model for the youth. Amen. It means a lot that we actually have a chaplain. Each of us have responsibilities to serve others. He actually goes to the hospital and visits people. He talks to uh, members as they're walking or sitting along and just asks them how they're doing, how they're feeling, where are they from, and that sparks a conversation. When uh, one person provides an example or an incentive to others to do uh, social responsibility or to perform ministry outreach in their community or neighborhood. It just multiplies and groups become communities and communities even sometimes become churches. Um, I really believe in the mission. I believe in what we do. Uh, I love the fact that I can talk about my faith without being reprimanded. Uh, she came to work here and just immediately hit it off and with everybody. Really, She's a very personable and very busy too, and does gets a lot of things done. She, there's no words to describe Jenny. She's just, like I said, she's my big sister and my best friend, and I couldn't ask for anything else than that. Legend has been in Fun Company for several years. Having the after school care program, it helps keep the kids out of trouble because they could be going home, eating who knows what, doing who knows what. But luckily, with a program like this, there are caring people there, and they're eating healthy, and again, they're socializing. And the staff, they're making sure that the kids are completing their homework and making sure they're doing what they're supposed to do. It comes from the words of Christ, for where two or three are gathered together in my name, I am there in their midst. For those who do not have a church, I have the opportunity of representing Christ to them and being a minister to them. These prayer requests are from one of our centers. Please pray that I know what love is. I've tried love before, and I've tried a lot of definitions, but my heart and my soul are empty. I'm really reaching out for God. Please pray that it's not too late for me. I even feel like I may commit suicide. I don't know who it is. I'm Rachel, and I stand for youth development. 
I'm Jenny, and I stand for healthy living. We ask, Heavenly Father, that you would bless our families. I'm Chaplain Larry, and I stand for social responsibility. Can one person make a difference in another person's life? Yes. 